Damn, motherfucker, what's up, players? Ain't done a home video in a while, so we wanna fucking run through, see where we're at, you know, a little checklist and shit. I'm gonna take you to the motherfucking Suite 3427 at the Palm Villas. And, uh, let's check this bitch out, you know what I'm saying? Motherfucker. I don't know if you can see it, but, uh, I put a little color changing LED up on the balcony and shit. We're gonna roll up the stairs right now. So we up here, you know how we do it. And uh this is the porch. But we still got some shit to do, you know. Yeah. I need to put in a park bench, you know, a stand-up ashtray, a welcome mat, maybe a little palm tree in the corner. Something like that. Here we go. Motherfucker. We walk in here. I changed the smell, you know what I'm saying? So we got like a little vanilla scent going on. Little glade, little air wick shit. So I walk up in here, man. Finally got that keg raider, man. Shit, need to clean it up a little bit. Can't leave that shit over so long, cause I need a little plastic cup because uh, the foam, you know. Look at that shit. Oh shit. Yeah, man, we need to change some of that the CO2 pressure and shit. Need motherfucking brother Dolph over here, but that motherfucker we just went out to see. Need to change that shit. But other than that, I mean. Uh, Minus the fucking shit. Works pretty good. I don't know what the fuck with that shit right now. Fucking worked fine earlier, but maybe we're running out of drink. I don't know. <laughs> fuck it. So, uh, trying to clean up the air, you know what I'm saying? Got a little oscillating fan. Got that got that wood grain and shit. I'm, uh, I'm actually going to replace this one. Move it to my bedroom and get a sharper image one. It's straight chrome. It's going to match this room a lot better, you know, because, uh, that's like gray, and I wanted to fucking chrome out with the rest of this shit. Okay, so we're coming up here, you know what I'm saying? I just put the China tea set in with the platinum trim. You know what I'm saying? We be doing it like rich people and shit now. Uh, shit straight. Porcelain China. Boom. Brother Dolph got me this new silverware set. It looks pretty nice. It's just going good. Put some fucking fake flowers up and shit. Trying to make it, you know, a little more homely in here. Brighten up the house, because this shit... Uh, you know, shit fucking, shit becomes too gothic after a while, you know, everything's black and shit, all black birch, you know? trying to fucking fix it up, got the sparklets going, you know what I'm saying, got plenty of water, we're good, my fucking Dave, who's this, this fucking amp over here all the time, doesn't, doesn't pick that shit up, what the fuck, not the fog machine on the day, I'm trying to keep it cleaner in here, but it's kind of hard, well, like, Got some remotes for the fucking shit, but I'm thinking I'm gonna have to get some Velcro, put them up on the wall because that shit. I need to do something on the tables. I'm planning on uh, got the little candy dish right now. I'm gonna upgrade that definitely to some Dove chocolate because that candy look look too childish and shit. But I think like some you know Dove chocolate or those little fucking truffles. I think that shit will be a lot more elegant, fucking more inviting. And uh, you know what I'm saying. Either that or like we're gonna put some like lanterns on the table, like I had back in the day. And, uh, either that or lava lamps. I don't know, man. I really haven't decided yet. I don't know what to, I'm trying to like get a theme going in here. So, got that dolly up. Uh, got that parental advisor. I actually ordered some posters now. They're not in yet, but I ordered the other dolly clock that I'm probably gonna put there because you know I just put the melty clock up and shit. So I'm gonna kind of keep that little theme because I want it to be like. A timeless feeling here, you know what I'm saying? Cause if I put up the gate and shit around the fireplace. <laughs> oh shit, got that odds on. If you need to do some recording, maybe just drop that rock star song and shit last week. And music's going pretty good with Greg and shit. That's cool. Uh, let's go out to the balcony for me. Out here, not a lot of light and shit, but uh, you know, I'm gonna fucking put them tiki torches in so I can see this. The LED man is pretty tiny and shit. But uh, if I want to have a cigarette or something, or I like make some like, you know, some cheese chips and some beans and make like myself a little, uh, you know, private private little Mexican uh, little Mexican fucking meal out here. And shit that I eat on the patio. I got a little light right there. Shit's pretty cool. Usually like, you might just see me post it up like this. I'm just like. I might have a cigarette right here. I'll be sitting right there. I sit up on the ledge and shit. Fucking eat right here, you know. 
It's, you know, it's kind of nice. I'm uh, trying to get a telescope and shit. It's uh, a little computerized telescope. It's like 439 or something on Amazon. I'm going to get that shit and you know, be able to look up at the stars. Shit. I need a little plant right there still. I'm falling behind. She's pretty cool. In here, man. Starting to get some stuff. Dog brought me the satellite dish. You know? I can't see what's up in here. Shit. Got myself that fucking pimp ass chair and shit. Extra tiki torch, you know, in case one goes out. With some more oil. Got uh got some camping gear. I got the sleeping bag, the tent, and uh got that Bunsen burner with some propane. I still need to get the easy up and shit. We're trying to go to Lake Mead. One. And the other dude, I forget his name and shit, the, the fucking South American dude, he cool. Motherfuckers from Rhino, Owen Tyrone and shit, so, you know, but, uh, shit, it was cool, man, I went down there, I got all sunburned and shit. So over here, you know, we got that, we got that deep fryer, man, probably shit need to be re-oiled, <laughs> I don't use it too much, that's just fat in there, I'm on diet, I was 207, as you see, and I dropped down to 191. You know what I'm saying? I lost like 16 pounds, but uh, I've been slacking this last week, maybe last two weeks, not, I ain't gonna lie, <laughs> it's been like two weeks, I've been putting on pounds, so I'm trying not to drink so much, but it's hard, because I mean, we've been doing a lot of music and shit, so I'm trying to drink, a little smoke, get in the mood, get fucking, you know, get active, get on that shit, get inspired, but we starting to do shows, we did Glenapalooza, you've seen it online, DMV's coming up, got another show on Friday at the rejuvenate a little coffee shop they say we can play that every friday and we got something big in august we're supposed to play there august 16th we'll see what happens i've been going through this shit right here you know trying to fucking uh all these places had open mic and they gone now so you know rejuvenate i found i still gotta call up these ones and see what's up and then you know maybe even holler at matt and so i can just be like hey can we come down to hurricanes and do an original just play our cd you know i don't think motherfuckers will know the difference but it, or there's, there's other shit too, we'll find it. Got some gadgets up in here. Got the motherfucking, uh, got the spice rack, got, got the fucking, uh, little Oster, uh, can opener here. Got the hot water heater, which is redundant because I got the, right there. But I had to get it because it's part of the set, you know. Got the fucking toaster, this. Got some new shit, got the, that. This is the fucking Breville. The fucking Icon fucking, uh, espresso machine. Bean grinder. Coffee brewer. We got the K cups and shit. This shit is tight. I got the juicer still, the Jack Lane. I got the Oster uh, microwave and shit. Running out of liquor, you know. I still got a little Cravassier XO and shit. But uh, I drank that Hennessy and that Remy and shit. Damn, we got some bud up in here. We got some of that whoop weed right there. That shit, this shit, fire right here, nigga. This shit. This shit be sprayed with some kind of steroid or something. I get fucked up. Still got a little handle. Greg be collecting fucking cigars and shit up here. I have a little collection and shit. That's cool. You know, this is a cool little gadget I had. They had this shit in England and I had to, you know, get this shit back right here. This shit just flip around real quick and then just like this shit, man. Like, I have two hands for this shit. Boom, that shit just come out like that. Boom, you can set your some shit. Be like, boom, I want salt, sugar, and some lime juice and shit. They had this shit in England, and I was like, I didn't think I'd ever find it. One day. I, just, I don't even know where I got this shit. Bed Bath & Beyond or something. I'd be shopping there a lot. Because fucking Bed Bath & Beyond is a shit. Got all this fucking cool shit. So anyway, the last thing I'm missing, and we just got this empty slot by the, the, the former, you know what I'm saying? Uh, for the uh, for the knife set. You know, I need to... I need some sharp knives, and I think then after that the kitchen should be done. Uh, man, I even went and I got these motherfucking things that you put the you put the fucking you know tomato soup and shit on, but you know the cupboards are too small. Fuck bullshit. I went and finally got some baking goods. Got some fondue pot. Got the fucking uh, got some cookie sheets. Got this cool little creme brulee set. This is a fucking like a torch. You put the creme brulee in and you burn right there. Shit, that's cool. And uh, some cake pans and shit. Went to Olive Garden and shit. Got that fucking, you know, the provolone cheese grinder. Cool. Um, little cool little set right here. I'm drinking. Having my fucking silverware sitting in the drawer for a while. Should get dirty. I don't like that shit. 
That motherfucking got some cool shit in here. I need a couple more, a couple more little gadgets. That's for the beat, the blend, the beaters right there. I got the fucking. Oh, it's sitting back there. Someday when I buy some cake mix, I may, you know, <laughs> I can use the beaters and shit. Gotta wash out them uh, little motherfucking uh, cups and shit right here. These, these containers. So I can put some cookies and shit. I made some, I made some cookies today. You know, I feel like I'm in the fridge. Cause now, I'm pretty good, but I don't like crunchy. Seven minutes, remember that. Otherwise, it won't burn. Damn, got that pizza. Fuck. See, cookies and pizza, beer. It's not good on the gut, man. It's just redundant. Got that triple beam, you know what I'm saying? Keeping the motherfucking G up in my shit. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, back in here. Got the fucking 50 inch plasma, the Pioneer. That the, uh. With the fucking. You know. The Sony fucking speakers. I got the 12 inch woofer. Along with the, uh. Wireless satellites back here. For my 5.1 system. It's cool. I keep the Grey Goose, you know. Just out here, just chilling, you know. Tempting me. Like, damn, I could get down all the time if I want. I like VIP service, man. Maybe like, what the fuck is this? This thing I gotta upgrade still. I gotta get the silver platter, but it come with some other shit and it's kinda expensive. So, this is plastic right now, you know. But I'm gonna get the real shit soon enough. Uh, so I keep that open with the with the carafe, just like the bottle service at Body English and shit, where they fill it up with like, you know, cranberry juice, orange juice. This thing right here is a cool little toy. This is an electronic ashtray, you know. That way I can just have it blunt. Sitting right there, and you can filter in. Or if I'm smoking, and I'm just like, I take a puff, I set it down, and just let that shit just ride in there, so it's not stinking up my house and shit. And then I can like kind of, you know, pace back and forth here when I set up the mic in the studio and fucking, you know, brainstorm and take a hit, you know, and be going off about like, man, you know, I'll do these hard times and shit. I'm trying to fucking get my life together, this and that, you know. Oh shit, I gotta do this, make this happen. I come back, take a hit, you know. That's how I'm doing it. That's how I'm living come back in here we got the studio going trying to get some pictures more pictures of i'm gonna get some more frames i'm gonna get some more posters and shit trying to make because this room is boring man you know i'd be sitting in here claustrophobic kind of it's kind of small and it's like there's no no place to sit except this be great having to get his bar stool or erica will go roll my other chair from the room and in the morning i'm like fucked up where's my chair i want to get my email fuck that so we're gonna try to get another one of these chairs and we're gonna try to get um I don't know, I'd like to get a little love seat, maybe with an inbuilt bed. That way, like, Randy comes over here, he can spend the night, or whatever. And, uh, at least there's a place to sit for people and shit. And shit. He brought this back, I might have to replace the other one, I don't know where it is. I want to get a PA and some wireless mic so we can start gigging and shit. Going through all these lyrics right here. This shit right here need to be retyped on this, because this is a fucking, a mess, dude. I got a few pug ashtray, finally. Said I was gonna get. Got the mini fridge right here in case I want to fucking have a little drink. You know what I'm saying? Going up in here. Of course I don't got no drink right now because uh, I drink it. So you know. But usually I keep all the 40s, like five, ten 40s up here, and then I stock all this shit up with like a 30 pack of the bud, and then I don't even have to leave this room. You know, it's just boom, shit right there. <laughs> you know. So that's the studio. We're trying to get this shit together. Anyway, we're coming through here. This bathroom right here, man, still needs a lot of work right here. See, this shit is just bare. They don't got no towels. I don't got no rug. No motherfucking, you know, toilet seat cover. I don't got no hand towels. I'm fucking... I got a sh just the vinyl part of the shower curtain. I don't got the top, but I'm going to go to Bed Bath & Beyond and shit. And, uh, you know, handle that shit. Hopefully, hopefully Friday, man. I don't know, though, because I got other shit I'm trying to buy, so... I've been ignoring it, but it's like, again, I sit in this room, I'm like, I don't even want to take a shit in here, because there's nothing to look at, there's no pictures, there's no TV, there's the bullshit, but these things are fucking badass, I got two, I got two of these now, three of them, got two in the other bathroom, see the sensor, sensor hand soap and shit, I might change the color of the soap, because I don't like that, that's a, uh, I forget what the fuck this is called, it's like vanilla with honey, or milk honey or some shit like that and I don't know 
It smells good, but I don't like that color. I'd rather like have some blue or some red, something coming out of that shit. <laughs> That's cool. Keep it stocked. You know, I threw some tampons in here in case the girls run out of their tampons and shit down their period. That way they don't have to be like, ah, I gotta go home. It's just like, hey, hook yourself up. Erica's bagging about it and shit. She's like, oh my god, no girl's gonna do that. What happened the next time she came over? I just started my period. I don't have any tampons. Damn. But then she says, I gotta get a trash can and shit because girls ain't kind of trying to run out with their shit. You know? And then I'm gonna try to flush it, clog my toilet, so trash can too, that's on the list. Anyway, this is how I stay organized right here. Get my rhino schedule, got the key, it's got a, uh, you know, all my work. Got work, 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 work. Got a full schedule and shit. And it got sporadically days off here and there, and half the time, like, boom. I have a call here, I might even have another call, they're right there, right there, shit, bullshit. This is my workout schedule, as you can see, like I said, I'm just slacking. I hit 191, but I was like 193, 194 this morning, so I'm kind of coming back up. I'm going to have to get on it right now, because now's the time. If I fuck up now, everything I did for the last six weeks was in vain. I, just, I can't let that happen, you know what I'm saying? That would be bullshit. I'm here. I just got this light today, I haven't put it up, I don't have the batteries, but it's like... Attach the light right there because real dark because I got black lights up in the ceiling, you know, so I can change the mood of this house. I can have a light like this, or I can flip these off and I got black light, black light, black light, another black light, and then one in the bathroom and the shower and shit. I flip that off and I put like I can put the disco ball on and shit. You know, finally, finally got that up there, you know. But I saw the batteries right now. I have to call uh, Danny and get his ladder and shit. Uh, finally got a little ironing board and iron, but. Oh, I need to wash in the dryer. Ah, fuck that shit too. We need a fucking uh, Velcro right here so this shit stays, you know. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Velcro, I'm mean, gonna put down the list. This hallway's kind of blank. I got that scar face right here, but this shit is kind of too plain. I'm thinking something bigger, something nicer, maybe, you know, and something right here, a mirror. I don't know. You know, I don't this is my little library right here again I need another light besides so I don't have to move the black light but maybe another one of those so I can get some light in here this is where I you know keep my books and shit I got my my rap shit my rhyming dictionaries my shit I got my audio shit the handbook of acoustics mastering audio I got you know miscellaneous shit bartending this is where I keep my psychological uh self help and uh shit like that um, cool shit, old yearbooks, you know, and on here I got, uh, Randy came through, brought me the Xbox and shit, he gave me, like, all these games, it's fucking tight, I've only played one of them so far, I haven't had a free minute, but, uh, and there's something wrong with the connection, because the TV in there, it makes it seem different and shit, got some old CDs, got another monitor and shit, if I get another computer, I need one because the one in the studio is going out. It's kind of scary. So I went to the bedroom and shit. Got the mother. The battery's gonna run out. So if it clicks, don't even trip because I got the power. I got the cord. I plug it in. I got the electronic dartboard and shit. This is pretty tight. I just put down the fucking uh, laser strip on the floor. Boom. What the fuck? Tripping. Tripping. Anyway, I just put that shit up. Boom. That shall keep your score. It's all good. <laughs> anyway, so I got this set up right here. I'm going to get another 50-inch plasma. The LG is on sale right now for $13.99. And uh, we actually already bought. That's my confirmation, motherfucker. You think I'm faking? Best buy, baby. There's our order coming in. We got a motherfucking uh, audio tower and a TV thing right here and shit. That shit's going to be cool. I'm going to fill that up and probably put some of my video games in here. I have the TV on the wall. Then I just, you know... Boom. I'll just be relaxing on my bed like, boom. Got that shit right there. Girl come over, I'll be like, yeah, we just go watch a movie, you know, pass out back here, you know what I'm saying? You know how I'm... Yeah, yeah, my buddy. That's how I'm gonna do that shit. I have it all set up and shit. And uh, what's cool about that is because then I can relax. And at the same time, I just flip off this little light right here. You know what I'm saying? I just flip the projector on. And boom, I got that shit on the ceiling. Let me turn off this other light so you can see it a little better. 
but this shit is fucking tight right here. You can't see it so good on the camera, but there's a lot of fucking stars in this shit. Look, this shit tight right here. And you like that. The project is pretty awesome. That way I can just sit back in my bed, relax, and uh, we can actually take off. We can make that a little brighter. Or I can lose that nebula all together. And then I got all these. All these stars and shit in here. This should be looking like Space Mountain and shit. So I'll be like, wow. <laughs> she look crazy. Uh, damn, motherfucker. I could be like doing a rap video right here, like, like that should be crazy. I'll be like, I'm that motherfucker running the block. I'm coming through holding the Glock. And I'm about to drop the top, I let it pop, I ain't fucking around, I be represent my city, I'm from the west coast, but I'm in LV, I'm just grinding, doing this shit, only rhyming, I be doing this all the time, and got the number one top charts, be climbing, uh, the billboard charts are climbing, uh, cause it's my time, and I'm big time, and like man, it fresh, I'm tight to death, I get your moms in a tight white dress, yeah, you know, <laughs> so it's shit crazy. Black lighting, you know, you up in here and shit. I'm doing it big in the Palm Villas. Trying to fucking get my shit together. Back in, back to the, uh, back to the tour. Anyway, I got some soap shoe shit up, you know. I know. Uh, got the, got the L desk still. Got the, you know, got the shit set up. <laughs> got some LAAJ. I'm under, I, I ordered some more posters and shit. Because this room, like I said, it's too bare. Look at that. There's nothing on the wall. So I don't know what I'm going to put there yet. I want something that really disguised me either. One of them, you know, LED uh, photos of the downtown LA or something like that. I'm going to put like maybe something right here. I got that Evanescence poster coming. I think I got, I got another Dolly one, another Dolly clock. And then I got the one for the higher education with the fucking cars in the garage. Shit, been typing up all the lyrics, getting ready to copyright that shit for real this time. You know what I'm saying? No more fucking around. Uh, did this cool little, did this little gig right here, you know? We're doing shows and shit. It's cool. We're gonna try to get that shit together. This right here, I don't know. Again, like you need a shelf or something right here. Something's wrong. The bed, I'm supposed to re-get the bed from Brookstone. That's gonna be another two G's because I want that tempur -Pedic. I want a king size that's gonna go from the edge of that desk to about here, you know what I'm saying? And then I can finally just relax and watch the cloud and my shit. And that'll be cool. And then we'll get rid of this fucking, you know, this little piece of shit right here. I'll go sell this on Craigslist or something because this fucking wood, what else in this house is fucking redwood? Everything black, and it's gotta be black, you know? Put some lava lamps on the side, maybe shit. I don't know, but I don't want to run out of room. I don't want to be like walking down a little tiny hallway here, right here, to go get my clothes. This is why. Right here, I need some uh, lights and shit. I need some. I put these up, but they don't really go here so well. And shit, I don't even have enough hats to fill that shit. So, um, I need this side. I'm gonna add some more lights in here and shit. And uh, you know, I need those Tupperware so I don't have to like. That's where my boxers go. That's where my boxers and all my socks and shit. Because I don't got nowhere to put them. It's bullshit. And those things are like $15 a piece, 15 30 45 60 60 and I want to do it over there. And I ain't got $100 to fucking put, uh, you know, my socks away. What the fuck is that? But I got to do it. That's where I keep all my swag. These are all my black shirts from all the gigs and shit, you know. Come over here. I got some rhino shit coming down here, you know. Finally got that safe. This is where I keep all my motherfucking, uh, my chains and my Rolex, and I got some, keep some drugs, some e pills, and shit for rainy day, you know? Maybe next week. Damn! You know what I'm saying? This is the master bathroom right here. This is, uh, you know, I got the sensor of soap, I got the explode little system, that's why I listen to. Usually I put the candles on, I might do that in a minute so you can see what it looks like. Got the, uh, I finally got the, uh, bubble shit back. So I can relax, got some Moet, got a little ashtray. I mean, the TV's a little too high, I'm gonna move it down here because it hurts my neck. But this thing, though, I got the jacuzzi in the back, so that's cool. This is some bullshit because I got the picture frame up, but I don't got a picture for it, so. 
We're gonna have to figure out what goes in the bathroom because I, I can't figure it out, man. Like, I don't want it to be cheesy. I want it to be classy, you know what I'm saying? Right here, I just got this thing from Sharp Image. This is some pimp shit right here. Boom. Practical fog free mirror with the light. That way I can shave in here. I don't have to have to leave the shower. And it's not like the cheap one that I got from Walmart that just falls to shit. Coming back in here, I need to add a light because I put the color light in there, but there's no light. I don't like that shit. I need a light. How you like that? I told you the fucking battery was gonna die. See, that's what happened because I lost my other camera. She broke. That's another thing that's on the list is a fucking Sony Digital 8 because I can't even watch none of my other videos, which has kind of made me stop filming. And that's why I'm fucking, this is like damn near the middle of fucking June. And I ain't even had fucking, uh, I ain't filmed shit about what I, what's been going on. And anyway, so I definitely need some more light in here. Put some cool pictures up and shit. That's me and that nigga Dave. Let's be on the board of the fucking, I don't know, some band. This wall right here, again, need a motherfucking picture because this shit, shit boring in here. Got a TV back here and shit. I don't even really watch it. Probably some porn in there or something, but, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's kind of a pain. I haven't really kept it plugged in because I got this orange and this yellow cable. And that shit just look really tacky. I mean, I know I could gaff tape it down, but... I mean, I need to find two white extension cords so that I can permanently, like, just gaff it down and then, like, keep it plugged in, you know what I'm saying? You know. So that shit need to be done. Need to get a... Come on, shit, I might change these pictures just to don't look... They're, they're fun, but they don't really look... Man, they don't really match this room. I want this bathroom, like... This one gotta be, like, the most fucking... Pimp shit. I got this scale. I don't really like it. Shit was $100, man, and it's just, like... I try to get all the shit where it, uh, for my diet so I could monitor my hydration and the body fat percentage and shit. And it does it, but all those numbers don't really mean nothing to me. It doesn't make sense. I should have read the instructions, I guess. And I don't like the color. It don't. It just, I should have got the one from Sharp Rumors that was black and chrome, but I fucking impulse buy. I was like, fuck, that looks like the best one here at Bed and Bath and Beyond. And I bought it. And I should have fucking done that. That was stupid. Make that mistake again. So, uh, that's the bathroom and shit. It's like real, it's real plain in here, alright? Let me sit down right now and I'm gonna explain to you where you're looking at. So, the lowdown, let's see what's been up. Andy stayed here for a month and a half. Motherfucker still owes me 160 bucks. Motherfucker's a bum. I didn't know he was just gonna fucking stay here and, and then move into some other place to be so I thought he was gonna get a, his own spot and get his shit together but he going he don't wanna live like that. He don't wanna live like a, a normal human being and shit. Yeah motherfucker. That's why this shit's pimp right here. I'll have to get another one of these the broom and shit. Boom. I'll put that shit right there. No smoke. Take it here. You're smoking. You know? Boom. That shit gone. It's cool. So anyway, motherfucking Andy's a bum. And uh, he came over here the other night in like a $200 outfit. Fucking starts counting up, talking about, oh, I'm going to give you bread right now. 20, 40, 60. Oh, oh, I can't give you that. It's my drinking money. I was like, motherfucker, you need to pay me my shit before you go drinking and buying clothes. And then I'm trying to establish myself. This motherfucker's just fucking around. You know what I mean? I told him, you know, if you need that 160, you know, to pay your rent and get your shit situated, that's fine. Because I know you got cheese, you make cheese, you make fucking 30 bucks an hour. You can afford to pay me off another week, and that's fine. I'll wait for it. But, I mean, he's not, he's not trying to get an apartment. He's just like, fucking, he's a mooch, bro. That's bullshit. I don't need it in my life. Um, stupid. You know, that motherfucker be taking hour showers and shit. Using all the fucking hot water and electricity and shit, jerking off and shit. <laughs> Motherfucker come in all dirty and leave his dirty ass. And then he leaves his fucking boots, talking about, walks right in, like grabs a fucking soda and shit, like he still lives here and fucking throws his shit in the closet. I'm gonna get it later. I'm like, well, fuck, I ain't a, I got a storage unit written on my door or some shit. Shit ain't public storage. Motherfuckers. Weak. And not fucking men, you know? Can't handle it. <laughs> Fuck it. 
little, uh, what else is the plan? A couple posters here and there, you know, and make this place more like home, you know, it's, it's fucking, I mean, it's starting to get really nice, you know, and I, I it's got the potential, and now I know it's gonna come, because, I mean, fuck, you look back at these Decatur videos, and when I have shit, you look back at the budget suites, or sleeping on Dave's floor and shit, you know, this is a this is a good come up in two years. I've been working my ass off, you know. Trying to get it together. Amy came over the other night. We were watching the Rocky movie right after we went to the bar and shit. After we went to the Chris Cracker show or what is the Uncle Cracker? And I was chilling with Brittany in the fucking uh, little cabana. We were just you know fucking passing that pipe, just sitting there like under the stars by the pool and shit. I was with Katie for that month, like hanging out with her and Megan and Leslie and uh, Danny and. You know, it was all partying and shit, and, uh... So... Other than that, what else is on the shopping list? I need a new car. Uh, got the system in that car. It's working again. Got a capacitor for the sub. It's, it's a little better. It doesn't cut out as much. It's still cut out sometimes if I'm cranking it all up, you know? I don't like that, so I might have to get another one. First, I need to get this bed and this entertainment center, and then after that, move on and get the rest of the little shit, and then go on to get the car. What else are we trying to get up in here? Um, need a PA system, wireless mics. That's just kind of expensive, but I'm going to have to get it. Me and Greg are talking about trying to get a rehearsal studio because it can't be like practicing our steps over here. I mean, I'm trying to really get on this gig. We got some good music now. We got fucking Rod on Niggas. We got ML King. Oh, God. We, I just did Leap of Faith. Uh, we dropping another one with Erica singing, like, it's them new boys. We're about to do that. We got, we got a bunch of, a shitload of beats, like 10 beats that they're just sitting there waiting for us to write, get that dough. Uh, yeah, show your belt buckle, clap, just a bunch of shit. Uh, just made him a, I made him a, a beat so he could start his, her solo song and shit. And trying to get our, our set list together, trying to get studio time. I was like, you know, 50 bucks an hour, 100 bucks an hour. But, I mean, we really need to invest in this shit. But, uh, I think it would be cool, like, the more shows, we're gonna go out there and meet people, meet contacts. Hopefully, you know, like, meet some girls and shit. And, you know, hopefully I'll be able to shine, you know. Every time I did karaoke, I'd be taking, you know, I'd be home with a girl and shit. Fucking, you know, I did that shit and I ended up at Maggie Andrea's house. Or, uh. You know, I did, when I would do the karaoke, I know Katie's house and shit, you know. Fuck. The karaoke, I met D. Oh, yeah, Vicky's coming down in August. That shit should be really cool. Um, uh, what else is up? That's all that's been going on lately. Met a couple new friends, you know, Ivan and all them and shit. And, uh. He's a good DJ, dude, and he's gonna give me some beats. He's got some, he does some Nintendo remix shit, it's pretty cool. I don't think we can use that because copyright shit, but good practice, make some good music, and, uh, you know, fucking network, meet some new friends, and, uh, it's cool, it's, you know, it's cool. <laughs> this room needs some fucking shit on the walls, isn't that echo? That's what happens when you don't have fucking glass on your walls. I need fucking pictures and shit. Look at that. The fuck is that? that shit is empty. <laughs> you looking around like <laughs> fake ass TV and shit. Out there, uh, you know. Look how look how much better that shit look. That wall got some some life on it. This shit. That shit yeah, look a bit. No. <laughs> I think uh I think that's what's up and uh I don't think I have anything else to say for a minute. Shit, I had the AC off for like only an hour or something like that and it's already getting hot back in here, you know. I don't know why this apartment holds heat for some reason. It cools off quick and then it heats up quick too. I forgot I was gonna show you the closet and shit. Got the new vacuum and shit. It's just pretty tight. Uh, got fucking, uh, got some more games up here. Need some more stuff in here. Started getting some shit. I got some, uh, some goggles right here. 
I'm trying to get some sink rings and some stuff for the pool, some fun stuff, you know. Got a Christmas tree finally. So I got a, I guess like a three hundred dollar tree that I got for ninety nine bucks on Amazon and shit. Fiber optic with uh, snow tipped in, uh, ends on the leaves and shit. Six and a half feet. This is the best tree I ever had. Just don't have no ornaments and shit. I set it up and had a little, you know, fucking. Has a little Christmas mix on, and he's like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> Tripping out and shit. I had Erica aim me fucking rolling. I'm like, what the fuck? This name crazy. Oh, you know what? I gotta take you down to the garage because you ain't seen that yet. That's the only other part of the. That's what I'm talking about out in here. This bum Andy, bro. I ain't been down here since he left. But look at this motherfucker leaving trash and shit up in here. What the fuck is that shit? So uh, anyway, I should actually. I was, as soon as I get the little TV upstairs I'm gonna bring this back upstairs and shit because then at least I have a look at this motherfucker leaving his tool he's got his tools and shit over here what the fuck is what the fuck is this shit anyway I keep the other uh oster down here because uh this shit uh if I if I did come down here and work out I need some water but I don't like it because I'm starting to look like it bugs back there fuck that this motherfucker leaving all kinds of shit. Got the treadmill, you know what I'm saying? Got them, got some weapons and shit. I come down here sometimes, but not enough as I should. I come down here and work out. I got the drum set up in there. That shit. You know. Yeah. Got a drum set up in there. I got tired of it in the house. This shit take up too much space. So, uh, got a little weight tree, but I'm gonna weights and shit. So when this goes through, that's the tree. Uh, this means I'm gonna have to come out here and empty this trash before I get more fucking roaches down here and shit. Uh, this is where I be beating up on Bob and shit. I be kicking him. Uh, yeah, I need to come down here more after the show. And, uh, that's the garage, baby. This shit like back in the day, homie. Huh? When I fucking did that one, uh, swimming around college, bro, I ended up losing that footage and shit. Fuck. Fucking keg is tapped, bro. Okay. Oh, well, fuck it. This is time for a re-up. You know? Uh-oh. Put an extra ashtray on the list. It's hard to fucking lean. Set that shit on. You know what I'm saying? So shit's crazy, man. We doing like. Did that fucking Nissan gig, dude. I did 105 hours that week. I think the first time. Shit was cool, I did stand in extra for that fucking vice president guy. And, uh, I had to stand on a stage and not move for like 15 minutes, shit was like... It was crazy. That's cool. It's hard, man. I live like a weird lifestyle and shit. That's why I push it to the limit and that's, that's why I'm getting this stuff, you know? And that's why I walk over to all my friends' houses and they mean they, they're not coming up like me. And Andy said it the best, like it's not how much money you make, it's just the way you spend it. I'm just trying to like come up and live the way that I'm supposed to live. You know, I wanna fucking roll nice cars and shit. And, you know, I'm gonna get this fucking, you know. I'm gonna fucking get the girl that I want, you know, I'm, I'm, I guess I'm pretty picky, I guess they say. But fuck it, I mean, I know what I want, it's that, and I gotta go for what I want. I like, can't half-ass it and get, like, I can't get the fucking Rubbermaid trash can, dude. I need that fucking chrome. I need that simple, you just it's like a hundred dollar trash can and shit. But that's what I gotta have. I gotta have that shit, you know? It can't be any other way. So, like, you know, I need the girl that I want. It's like, she's out of reach right now. I, I need to be fucking balling, I need to have higher status, you know, fucking more money, uh, be able to provide better, maybe, you know, have a bigger home and shit, better body, I don't know, there's a lot of improvements that I need. I don't 
I do this shit, you know? I know what I want and I gotta make it happen. Can't, I can't be fucking wrong. I'd rather fucking have bottle service. Mm. I'm gonna get a maid too. Uh, I'm gonna get one maid for like 50 bucks now. I'm gonna fucking watch you clean my house. That's fucking how bottles fucking do that shit.